Hello guys, in this video tutorial, I will show you how to implement QuickShot algorithm in c -sharp. So I have already created a console application in Visual Studio 2019. So let's start implementing the QuickShot. So before going to QuickShot, let's uh, implement some helper functions. So first I will implement Schwab. It will swap the array items. So we use that. The third variable technique, temp variable techniques for swapping the item. Then we need a partition function. The partition function will divide the array into two parts based on the pivot selection. So we will implement public static int partition int and. So I will consider first item as a partition. Then we need a uh, another variable swap index that I will set as a start. Then we will loop the array from start plus one and it will go till end of the array. Now you will check the current item is less than the pivot then we will swap the item so let's make the swap as a static so swap array i and start start index swap index okay and finally we will reset the position of swap so we will call swap array start and swap index so now our swap index position is in the last we will return the swap index position now it's time to implement the quick shot so quick shot uh, uh, function it will take the array and the start and and position of the array we will first check if a start is less than and then we will find the pivoting index by calling the partition function then we will recurse the quick shot call on both part the left and right so we will start with the uh, start with tell pivot and pivot and then another recursive call from pivot plus one till add and finally we will return the sorted array so now let's test the algo so i have created one array minus one two twenty one hundred minus two now I will call the quick shot and then array dot length and we will store the sorted result in the different variable and then I will print the sorted array by using for each.
make some white space and then now let's run and see the output so you can see the array is sorted properly okay so that's it for this demo please like and subscribe my video and let me know your suggestions and feedback in the comment box bye